got a Samsung smartphone and hate that Bixby button and want to disable it altogether? Well, we've got a better idea as in this video, we tell you how to remap the Bixby button on your Samsung Galaxy device. Let's get started. Go to the Google Play Store and download the BX Actions app. Link is in the description down below. Now open the app and follow the setup prompts to get started. Once set up, on the home screen you'll see two toggles at the top that you can remap, Bixby buttons and the volume buttons. Let's first talk about the Bixby button. Press the toggle switch on to remap. Over here you can see the app allows you to assign certain actions when you single press and long press the Bixby button. This is the free version of the app that we have tested out and because of that only single press actions work. If you want to assign long press actions as well then you'll have to buy the app for an amount of 99 rupees. But fret not, even if you don't purchase the full version, the app works well for what it offers for free. Let's go on and see what all actions can be assigned. Up top you can see you can totally disable the Bixby button, but that's not what we'll do. So these are all the actions you can assign. Let's test it out with the Google Assistant. And it works. Now let's test it out for the flashlight. And it works well again. So as you can see, you can assign a variety of different actions. With a single click, you can go to settings, launch an app, open the camera, play pause the media, and all this works flawlessly. And it's not just the Bixby button that can be remapped. The volume buttons can be remapped as well. With the volume buttons too, you can only assign a single press task in the free version. But this also totals to four actions using the volume buttons. Single press volume up, single press volume down, single press volume up on the lock screen and single press volume down on the lock screen. In all, with this app, you can customize up to five actions using the Bixby and the volume buttons on your Samsung smartphone using the BX Actions app. And if you want a deeper control, then you can always purchase the full version. And that's about it for this video. We hope you found this helpful. Thanks for watching and for all things tech, log on to Gadgets360.com.